What's up, King fam? Welcome back. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for being here. If this is your first time visiting the channel, welcome. My name is Dennis. It is a pleasure to have you. So, um, I love Gabriel Henrique. It's not, it's not a secret. Uh, I'm, I will do any and everything that Gabriel releases. I was huge for him on AGT. Um, but you know, I've seen this video that, that popped up on my screen. It's a video that says what America's got talent didn't tell you about Gabriel Henrique, where I've gotten some inside access to what goes on with Gabriel here and there, uh, through the fan club, through some of the fan, some of his family members. I'm interested to see what this video talks about. This is a different kind of reaction for me. It's not a music reaction. I'm just basically watching something to see what they say, the information they give. So um, hopefully they're not saying anything that is incorrect. Um, I'm sure a lot of you guys know more than than maybe they do. Definitely more than I do. So uh, yeah, tell me if they say something that's incorrect, tell me in the comment section. But yeah, let's go ahead and dive into this. See what see what's going on with Gabriel or see some things about Gabriel they didn't tell us about. Before we get started, please make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, make sure notifications are turned on. You don't want to miss out on future reactions and it really does help the channel grow. The channel's kind of been in a lull, almost a decline here the last little bit. So please uh, do those things. Subscribe if you haven't, hit the like button and, and leave your comments. It really does help the channel get into the algorithm and grow. So please let's continue to grow. Uh, in the description box below this video, you'll see the links to all of our social media. Give us a follow. And like I said, drop your comments in the comment section. Tell me your thoughts on this. If they got something wrong, correct them. Uh, if there's something else you want to share, put that down in the comment section. But yeah, without further delay, let's, uh, let's go ahead and get started. Thank you guys so much for being here. Greatly appreciate each and every one of you. Come on. As soon as the audience heard Gabriel Enrique's rendition of Run To You, the world fell head over heels in love with his unique and mesmerizing voice. True. In that electrifying moment on the AGT stage, his voice carried a rare and irresistible charm that resonated with audiences across the globe. While America's Got Talent introduced the world to Gabriel and his extraordinary singing talents, there's actually much more to his story than what meets the eye on the televised stage. Many people would be surprised to learn that this wasn't the first talent show appearance of the Brazilian singer. Join us as we explore what America's Got Talent didn't tell you about Gabriel Henrique. This was a stunning performance right here. This right here should have got him to the finals. Taking half my pride, ain't I wrong? Gabriel Enrique hails from Brazil and was born on the 8th of January 1996. Okay. His journey in the world of music began at the tender age of three. Birthday's coming and astonishingly, up. He never received any formal singing lessons. Nope. Music runs deep in his family, with his father being a producer and guitarist. Gabriel's musical influences were largely shaped by his father, who introduced him to the music of various singing legends. In addition to his passion for music, Gabriel... I want to go there and see that. Oh my gosh, that is huge and beautiful. I want to go there so bad. ...is a devoted Christian. One notable thing about him is that he prefers to keep his personal life relatively private. He, does. he tends to steer clear of the limelight and shares limited details. What's up, Will? What's up, William? How you doing, brother? ...details about his family life. Gabriel's journey in the music industry began to gain significant recognition when he participated in a singing competition in his hometown of Brazil. In 2019, he showcased his talent on the popular show titled Programa do Raul Gil. His performances on the show left a lasting impression on both the judges and the audience. Should I go back and do reactions to that stuff? I think I've done like maybe one from that. But should I go back and do some more of that older stuff? You guys let me know in the uh, comment section. Catapulting him into the spotlight. One of the standout aspects of Gabriel's performances was his choice of songs. He boldly took on the challenging and iconic songs of prominent female artists like Mariah Carey and Celine Dion, demonstrating Wait, his Houston. vocal prowess and versatility. His ability to tackle these powerhouse vocals earned him admiration and applause from music enthusiasts. Mm -hmm. However, with growing fame also came scrutiny. Gabriel's vocal coach faced criticism on the blog, Teacher Paul Reacts, where his singing technique and style were dissected and analyzed. This critique, though constructive, further fueled discussions about his talent and potential. 
One of the moments that added to Gabriel's popularity was a duet video he posted on social media. In this video, he showcased his impressive falsetto alongside a quartet of talented girls, collectively delivering an R&B tune. This captivating performance resonated with viewers, leading to the video garnering more than 5 million views. What video is that? I don't know what that video is. Can someone leave that in the in the description box of this, please? If you guys know what video that, that he's talking about, please let me know. After the talent show, Gabriel's journey to social media stardom was an obvious step. It all began when he created a captivating cover version of Bruno Mars' hit song, Just The Way You Are. This video quickly gained traction and garnered over 30,000 views, catching the attention of music enthusiasts and fans alike. On November the 9th, 2020, Gabriel showcased his musical talent in a heartfelt duet with his father, further solidifying his presence in the online music scene. This collaborative effort resonated with viewers, earning him even more recognition and praise. Gabriel's social media influence extends to TikTok, where he maintains an account under the handle at Gabriel Henrique. With an impressive following of 710.4 thousand followers and 7.2 million likes, his engaging content has contributed significantly to his popularity on the platform. His online presence doesn't stop there. Gabriel also curates YouTube, and shares his music on his official YouTube channel, YouTube. at Gabriel Henrique Music, which boasts 530,000 subscribers. Through his platform should be way more than that to be honest with you he should be up to a million yet but i believe he'll get there he'll get there pretty soon he uh, gabriel keeps releasing content keep touching the world he'll get there um, he continues to captivate audiences with his original compositions and covers in the ninth episode of the agt season 18 auditions the talented singer from brazil took center stage he relied on an interpreter to communicate with the judges due to his limited english proficiency Cousin. as he was still in the process of learning the language Gabriel expressed his eagerness to make the most of his first visit to the USA. Gabriel's audition began with his rendition of Run To You. As he started singing, the entire room, along with all four judges, was left in awe of his amazing voice. His effortless yeah. execution of high notes set him apart and earned him a standing ovation. Heidi compared him to a combination of Whitney Houston and Mariah Carey, describing him as incredible. How he expressed his surprise at the powerful voice that emerged from Gabriel, likening him to the finest pop diva. Simon found this singer intriguing and believed that his church background had contributed to his talent. Sophia was deeply impressed by his perfect, spectacular performance and couldn't find enough words to describe it. But her enthusiasm was evident as she interrupted the judges and without hesitation pressed the golden buzzer, catapulting Gabriel to the next level of the competition. The golden button, not buzzer. But uh, anyway, um, all of a lot of this stuff I already know. So I'm waiting for him to hit me with stuff that I didn't know. A couple of things here and there. I'm wondering, does the narrator know about the second performance that day? Tation pressed the golden buzzer, catapulting Gabriel to the next level of the competition. On the September 19th episode of America's Got Talent, the fan-favorite Brazilian crooner returned to the stage for the first time after receiving Sofia Vergara's golden buzzer. This time, he surprised the audience by choosing to perform Something Beautiful by Jacob Banks. Sofia hailed his performance as perfection and likened to Choosing to perform maybe strong, um, more like urged to perform. ...him to an angel. The judges unanimously gave Gabriel a standing ovation and praised his powerful performance. Simon acknowledged that Gabriel's song choice was unexpected, but lauded him for nailing it, even considering it superior to his first audition. He suggested that Gabriel might have secured a spot in the finals. Which he Heidi Klum was impressed by Gabriel's unique talent, especially in the latter part of the song, where he showcased his extraordinary vocal abilities. She emphasized how he stood out from other singers with his incredible performance. Howie Mandel, initially unsure about the song choice, changed his tune after Gabriel hit a high note. He believed that Gabriel's vocal range and memorable performance would ensure his progression to the no next can, stage of the no competition. One no one Since he was it. receiving so much praise from all the judges, and even fans were saying only good things about him, the results that were later announced were so shocking. On September the Crazy 20th, shocking. host Terry Crews announced the four artists competing in the instant save. Fans had only a brief five-minute window to... This was ridiculous. That was ridiculous that they went so far.
cast their votes for their preferred act to secure a spot I in the finale that. next Anybody week. Can do that. The anticipation peaked when the results were finally unveiled at the episode's conclusion. Silly. Sophia appeared disheartened when it was revealed that the Ramadani brothers had secured a spot in the finals, with only one seat left after- Ramadani brothers shouldn't have been in there either. Sorry. To the 82nd Airborne Division- They shouldn't have been in there either. Chorus received America's vote. Sophia had the opportunity to nominate Gabriel for the instant save wildcard. The judges made their wildcard selections. Simon Cowell opted for Chioma and the Atlanta Drum Academy. Heidi Klum selected Herwell LeGaylard and Howie Mandel chose Avangarde. Fans hurriedly voted for their wildcard instant save choice and Avangarde emerged vic- Silly. Ridiculous. Silly. Victorious, completing the top 11 acts. Sophia's reaction did not go unnoticed on social media. Some viewers playfully mocked her, suggesting that her initial confidence in America's choices had waned. Others expressed their satisfaction that the Japanese ladies advanced, implying that America's vote was a deviation from Sophia's golden buzzer selection. Comments also pointed out that Sophia's choice seemed predictable, with some expressing surprise that she had not chosen Gabriel for the wildcard spot. The public's response to Gabriel's elimination was divided, with some speculating that he may have lacked that elusive X-factor or standout moments in his performances. Comparisons were made with other contestants. Standout moments and X-factor of a grown man with a beard being able to hit whistle notes effortlessly in a live performance? Uh, I, 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 Contestants, with one viewer suggesting that Gabriel might not have delivered the same impact as some of his peers. Gabriel Enrique's elimination from AGT Season 18 ignited a debate among fans, with many expressing their disappointment and questioning the judges' decisions. Exactly. As the competition unfolds, fans are eagerly anticipating further surprises and twists Garbage. in the journeys of the selected Garbage. talented performers. Although Gabriel may have faced a... Playing drums to a backing track is not talent is not talent i can do it anybody can play drums to the backing track anybody can, sh can shimmy their shoulders and can do that it's not talent elimination from america's got talent the future ahead of standing on top of your brother and him walking up and down stairs in funny different ways is a circus act maybe talent but it's not good. There's only so much you can do with that. Him is undoubtedly bright and promising. But what AGT may not have highlighted is the growing and dedicated fan base that Gabriel has been building steadily now through his social true. media presence. That's true. Every day, his following on platforms like TikTok and YouTube continues to expand, drawing fans from all corners of the world. Higher it's only higher. a matter of time before Gabriel evolves and becomes. This right here, I'm going to tell you, I'm, narrator, I'm going to tell you something you didn't know. There was a series where Gabriel did these car, did these recordings in his car. He would play the song on this car stereo and would sing in the car because people were saying, were saying that he was pitching his vocals, that he was not really hitting those notes. So the way to, the way to combat that, not even in front of a microphone, he's just singing in his car. Comes a beloved singer in Brazil to a true global star. The key to Gabriel's future success lies in his unwavering commitment and dedication to his craft. By continuing to work hard, refine his skills, and produce captivating content, he has the potential to capture the hearts of audiences worldwide. His strong social media presence will play a crucial role in connecting him with an even broader fan base and industry opportunities. In a world where talent can find its audience regardless of geographical boundaries, Gabriel Henrique's journey is far from over. With persistence, passion, and the support of his growing online community, he's poised to achieve remarkable success and make a lasting impact on the global music scene. Okay, I pretty much knew everything that this guy talked about. Only a few things earlier on that I didn't know about. I'm really, I really am curious to see um, the video that he was talking about. This garnered five, this garnered five million views. So if you guys know what whatever that video is, please put that down in the comment section. I would love to see and react to that. And do you guys want me to go back and react to some of Gabriel's earlier things when he was on that uh, that talent show before? Let me know uh, your thoughts on that down in the comment section also. Um, like I said, uh, for this to be something that said what America's Got Talent didn't tell you about Gabriel Henrique, yeah, that's true. America's Got Talent did not tell us all that stuff. 
But, you know, people that are fans of Gabriel, we pretty much knew all that stuff anyway. So, um, anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed the reaction. For those of you that don't follow Gabriel as closely as others do, maybe you learned a thing or two here. That's, that's what I hope that you did. And uh, I really want to see that video that he was talking about, the 5 million plus views with Gabriel and four, uh, and four, other, and four ladies. That would have been cool. Uh, that'd be real cool to see. But if you enjoyed the reaction, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Make sure notifications are, tur are turned on. Excuse me. You don't want to miss out on future reactions, and it really does help the algorithm. It uh, really helps the channel grow within the algorithm. Like, we've been declining a little bit. Let's build it up. So please do those things. Uh, in the description box below the video, you'll see the links to all of our social media. Please check those out. Give us a follow and drop your comments in the comment section. What did you think about this? Did you learn anything? Did you already know this stuff? Can you send me the link to that video that he was talking about? Pretty please. Thank you. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thank you guys so much for being here. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you. Please keep coming back for more content, more videos, and I'll see you very soon on the next one.